Expert witnesses. Locating and using qualified and ethical professional experts uh, is a real talent. Uh, most of my cases do not have unlimited funds to finance this. The expert can be in a family law case in the form of a um, child abuse counselor, uh, can be a, an engineer reconstructing an accident site or an auto accident by looking at the marks on the highway and the deformation of the vehicles. Uh, it can have to do with blood. Uh, medical doctors can be experts. Over the years, I've slowly but surely developed a pool of people that I have the greatest confidence in. In fact, when I have a case that's going to take $30,000 or more out of pocket, uh, there are a relative few number of firms in West Virginia uh, that can fund those. By being on the Board of Governors of the West Virginia Association for Justice, I've learned who those people are. Uh, with their help, we've attained a number of seven-figure settlements and many, many six-figure settlements. And the percentage that the client pays remains the traditional amount, as we've discussed in other uh, uh, clips. Uh, same with mediation. If you mediate hundreds and hundreds of cases, you learn who the better mediators are. Not because they're going to favor your client, but because they get results. You know, experience is important. Uh, we had a big debate about that in our last election. But experience uh, tied with uh, good judgment and common sense, technical skills, and professional uh, qualifications, including continuing education. Uh, those are the things that I favor, and as long as I've got the good health that I've got, I intend to do that and to try to learn every day of my life and represent my clients vigorously. Thanks for watching this or all of my video clips. I hope they were of some use to you.